All right, guys and gals, welcome on back. Case number two of our four case 2020 tops Gypsy Queen, 40 box player break. Uh, we'll do a recap as we did at the end of case number one. I did post the video link at the top of the chat there for case number one video if you guys are looking for it. It's still processing, so it's not showing on the channel yet, but uh, that link will get you through to it. Um, I'm not sure why it gives us a link on our end, but not fully view viewable there. But anyway, just a little early heads up there if you're looking for the case number one video recap at the end. We'll do a recap at the end of this case as well for number two. And then I did st uh, post the starting time or the starting link as well for case number three tomorrow. Same format, we'll do cases three and four. This one started to break on me a little bit. All right, box number one, case number two, coming up. Sean, let's see if we can put him on the board for you. Good sir, looking for a little Big Daddy Fatty or Mr. Moncada. There we go. Let's see if we get some gold action or better on the box toppers here. We're pretty much primarily blue and indigo, but pretty nice though. Some nice parallels in that first case for sure. Good luck, David. Let's see if we can put it on the board, buddy. There we go. All right, gold. So start it off. GQ gold to 50. Nice, Brandon McKay, rookie. Solid little hit there. Mr. Abreu. All right, very nice, Mr. McKay. GQ gold refractor rookie. Three out of 50 on this one. Abreu and Marte on the base. All right, box number one, coming up. Lionel, how, how you doing, buddy? Good to see you. Hope all is well. As well as can be, right, these times. Fortune Teller Mini, Austin Meadows. Mr. Lux. We'll do the same thing, do a base count on the top guys there, give you guys an idea on the hits, or the base, I should say. Bobisha, Wheel of Fortune, mini rookie, or tarot rookie. Yeah, good to have you aboard, bud. Oh, here we go. First autograph out of this box put on the board for Michelle Baez. Rookie auto action on the board. Almost look like a portrait. It's not a variation, no. It almost looks like a portrait there with the uh, clouds or some heavenly, <laughs> heavenly figure there. All right, new auto, first auto. Thanks. We'll take a peek every now and then for bazooka backs. Three pretty nice ones in the first case. Let's see if we get a four bazooka back case in this one. Cedric Mullins. This is the Indigo to 250. Two ten out of two fifty on this one. Didn't see a red well, the red parallels are tough, one in six cases, but See if we can run into one here sooner than later. Base. Rick and Miranda, howdy. They're looking for some Keon Wong action. Let's see if we can put him on the board. A little San Francisco. Casting hair, fortune teller mini.
Kyle Lewis rookie. Kingery. Christian Vasquez, missing nameplate variation in this box on the board. And we do see one, about one per box, 23 packs, so one per box on the missing nameplate variations. Aaron Judge, tarot card. Young, Fortune Teller Mini Insert. They do have mini rookie autos as well this year, too. So we did hit one in our team breaks. Be fun to hit one in uh, these. They are multi-case hits, one every three or four cases, I believe. So we should run into one. Peace. Ted Williams, high number short print. We did get him in the first case. Back on the board here with this one. Congrats. Kino, base. Nola, base. Base. Quick gander at the uh, bazooka backs here. Well, we haven't found one yet that we have missed, but still never hurts to take a quick peek here, just to be safe. Still got our second autograph coming up as well here. Got the Michelle Baez Rookie Auto on the board first. Nice Rafi Devers. Blue to 150 on this one. 97 out of 150. Nope. Newsy, base. Sorry, looking for some action on, on employees this as well. Springer tarot card insert. Colin Moran, logo swap on the board for the Colin Moran spot. We did see seven of these in the first case. I don't see if that holds true there. You're usually going to see seven or eight logo swaps in a case. All right, got our first there. Base. Michael Chavis, Fortune Teller Mini. All right, second autograph should be in one of these three. Good luck. Base. There we go. Autograph coming up. Oh, that's cool. Have not seen one of these yet. Put it on the board. Nice Mike Mucina. Black white to 50. That's cool. Solid hit there. Congrats to the Mucina spot. I'm not sure if he's got base autos or if his autos are short printed, but that's the first Mucina we've seen. 31 out of 50 on this one. Congrats, congrats. All right. 
Last pack of box number one, case number two, coming up. Base. Quick check here for any additional bazooka backs. Base. All right, box number two, coming up. A nice gold refractor on the uh, Brennan McKay rookie in the first box topper. Nice start there. See if you can add to it for a nice red or super along the way. Topper number two. Oh, I thought it was some KB action for you there. Nelly Cruz back on the boomstick. Blue to 99. Seth Brown, Chris Bryant on the chrome base. David, I think we got something in the works here. Let's see if we can put it on the board for you here in case number two. 26 out of 99 on the Nelly Cruz. Yeah, I mean, if we're going to pull it, let's get it on sooner than later. I hate to make you wait, sweat it out to the last case, but... Sometimes we have to. Hopefully we don't. Scherzer, Fortune Teller, Mini. KB, Tarot. Aaron Savale got him in case number one. All right, back on the board here. Start case number two. Congrats. Is that our first double up on the autographs? Mm, I think so. Yep. Yeah. All right. Congrats and again. Let's see if we can get you some parallel action. <laughs> Thomas, well, let me save it before I hit, but let's see if we can get you on a board. Matt Olson, Indigo parallel here to 250. Two thirty-five out of two fifty. Fortune Teller Mini, Jordan. That's our first of the case here. Ended up with eight base on the Jordan base count in the first case. Kia, looking for some action on him for you, sir. And man, so we can get you guys a nice low numbered parallel. Austin Meadows. Missing nameplate variation uh, on the board for the Austin Meadows spot. He does have autos in this as well. Good for second auto coming up. Bregman, tarot card insert. Dante, uh, no Trevor Bauer parallels of no, no auto. I don't, I don't know if he has. Did I see him on the autos? Oh, no auto, but no parallel yet. Good sir. Let's see if we can run into one for you here. Take okay, a quick peek here for any bazooka backs.
Gavin Lux base. Sammy Sosa, high number short print. Did get him in case number one. Back on the board here for number two. Congrats there. First double up on the short prints. That first bazooka back should be getting pretty close here. Kino Place. Eric Hosmer. That is the indigo? No, that's the blue to 150. Hosmer spot on the board. 104 out of 150 on this one. Nice. Mm, variation coming up. Good luck. JD Martinez. Now, which one is it? Jackie Robinson Day with the logo there. Jackie Robinson Day image variation short print. All right. On the board for the J.D. Martinez spot now. Who did we get? We got Syndergaard on the sh uh, Jackie Robinson Day variation in the first case. So we got one early enough here. Maybe we do get a second one in this case. We've seen, seen cases with them. I have two of them like every now and then. Oh, really? So he doesn't even have a regular auto, Dante? I didn't know. i got to look at the checklist. Yelich. <laughs> My ears need to hear it. <laughs> uh, Verlander. Nice logo swap variation. Our first Verlander, right? First, uh, first hit on him. Luba, base rookie. Tatis, fortune teller, mini. Still looking for our second autograph. Yeah. Ooh, well that would explain it. A little thicker on this one. So we got ourselves more than likely an autographed garment. Hmm, not sure exactly what else. Power portrait patch. I haven't seen those. I'm not sure if they're thick or not. All right, looks like a garment hit. Put it on the board. Nice. Get them uh, back to back cases. These are supposed to, well, they are six, every six cases, give or take, it's based on the odds. All right, let's go front. This one.
All right, guys. Sorry about that. Let me check my end to make sure that it's not a problem on my end, but I got a glitch. Yeah, it was Max. Alright, let's see how that works. Sorry about that, gang. Yeah, that was Maxwell. But I'm still getting an error on my end, so I'm not sure. Hmm, very awkward. Okay. Yeah. Let me check something real quick on my end, guys. So that was Max. 26 out of 50 on that one. I do apologize there. Kind of a heck of a time to go out on it. Let me take a look at something real quick to make sure it's not interfering with our signal on our end. All right, there we go. Error message is gone. I don't know what happened between me getting up and going, but something seemed to have caught up there. Okay, I was just okay to proceed now. I'm just was kind of cautious with the error message, so I do apologize. That was the last pack of the box, and that was a Max Muncie. That's a little anticlimactic there, so I do apologize to the Max Muncie spot on that one. Yeah, we never really get a problem like that, but you know what it could be with everybody being, everybody being really, you know, inside for the most part on the internet. I wouldn't doubt that the bandwidth is a little clogged, but yeah, hopefully that's the uh, only occurrence there, so. Okay, little speed bump, back at it. Box number three. Ah, second gold. There we go. Didn't get one in the first case. Two in the first three boxes here. This one going to Justin Verlander. There you go. Got the logo swap to get on the board there. Nice gold. Mookie Betts base. Two out of 50 on the Verlander. Start with the glare there. Bryce Harper on the chrome. Woogie. All right, box number three. Blue Bob Bass. Dylan Cease, Fortune Teller Mini. Yeah, but I did want to let you know it was a problem on my end, too, so you guys weren't, like, wondering what's going on on your end. So, do apologize there. That seems to be more on my, my side than anyone else's. Trout. Tarot card. Bo. Oh, snack about me. Adbert. All right. Put on the board for the Al Zole spot. Procchiato. Congrats on this one. So, Nico, looking for you, buddy. Got Robo Garcia, got Alberto Alzole. Let's see if we run into a Nico Horner as, on the board as well.
Indigo to 250, Matt Duffy. Yes. 96 out of 250 on this one. Rob, looking for a two bay. Let's see if we can put one on the board for you, good sir. Haven't seen him in any of our other cases yet, so maybe we got a little running head start on him. Fortune Teller Mini, Nikki Senzo. Nico, base, base rookie. Missing nameplate variation, Trey Mancini. On the board with that one. I'm sorry, Anthony Santander. Whoa. I was seeing Mancini there for a second. Right-handed Oriole. Uh, I'm going to look a little closer there. No, uh, Anthony Santander. Apologize there. Oh, he only has the lineup. Well, I guess if it makes sense. <laughs> We haven't seen a lineup auto yet, so maybe we got a running head start on that one. But all right, see if we can put it on the board though. I get it now. Well, it would be cool to see one. It's top of the day bar. Mike Trout, Fortune Teller Mini. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Oh, David. In a way, I wish we did as well. Reggie. Did get Reggie Jackson high number short print in the first case. So, yeah. Sosa and Reggie now double up on the short prints from last case. What is that? You only a couple sequences on the short print, so double up on a couple. You can miss a couple of guys for a case or two. Alzo lay the first auto here, see if we can get a parallel in the second, though. Although the Mike Nucina was a pretty sweet auto in the first box. Black white parallel to 50. Austin Hayes. Baltimore action in this box. Two out of 50 on the Austin Hayes, black, white, parallel. Nice. Quick peek here for some bazooka back action. Haven't seen one yet, should be pretty close. Did get three in the first case. Variation coming up. Oh, okay. Sammy Sosa. So we got another parallel short print. Just got the second short. Just got a second short print at a blue out of 150. Congrats to the Sosa spot. Again, these are tough. One in six. Uh, one in 605 packs. That's our second one now. Going on just over just over 300 packs about. 45 out of 150. Congrats there. Still got the second autograph due up as well. Freddie Freeman tarot card.
Uh, logo swap variation. Garrett Hampson. Laying down the sacrifice, but what a man. <laughs> Not the most flattering uh, baseball card, though, I'd have to admit. It's like, oh, I get your baseball card. They, they got me doing a sacrifice, but... Yeah. <laughs> Not the most comfortable of situations I can imagine, either. All right. A logo swap variation. Hampson on the board. Oh, very nice. That's exactly what I was talking about, too, with those um, bonus packs, right? Really, they're just kind of a couple dollars. But, you know, some of those rookies now from that 18 crop... Looking pretty good. I saw some Lamar graded. I mean, it depends if it's a perfectly great, perfectly gradable version, but even a PSA 9 is going to carry good weight down the road on those. Yastrzemski, base. Jordan, base. Cool deal, man. Thanks for sharing on that one, Dave. Base. Labor Day, Fortune Teller Mini. in this pack or the last pack coming up there it is put it on the board Bobby Bobby Bradley rookie auto on the board for the Bobby Bradley spot now there we go. congrats congrats so Al Zole and Bobby Bradley rookie autos Last pack of box number three. Flavor base. Quick peek here for uh, Bazooka back. Mm, no, looks good. Ooh, all right. Box number four. Coming up. <laughs> I gotta look that up. I'm not sure. I, I gotta look up see Kyle Seeger's uh, Stadium Club now that you mention it. <laughs> Chrome Topper coming up. Two gold refractors already on the board in the first three boxes. Uh, Justin Verlander in the last box, and then we got a nice Brandon McKay gold refractor in the first box. Little bubblegum action. Eugenio Suarez. That is, I'm not sure. Indigo to 150. Yeah, Indigo to 150. Verlander base. AJ Puck base. One thirty eight out of one fifty. All right, box number four. Christian Yelich, Fortune Teller Mini. Bellinger, tarot card insert. Well, put it on the. Now we've got all the Dodgers on the board, I think. Only took about what, 13 boxes here. Matt Beatty, professional hitter. Blue. Sorry, I take that back. Indigo auto to 150. Congrats on this one. 77 of 150. First auto out of this box. Jordan Base Rookie. Uh, 
There's a Fortune Teller Mini Indigo Parallel. Paul DeYoung. We got the Trout Green to 99 on the first case. DeYoung Indigo to 250 on this one. Got the auto as well on Mr. DeYoung in the first box. Case number one. Add a little parallel action here. There we go. Sit straight. Justin Dunn, blue rookie parallel to 150. 14 of 150 on this one. Congrats there. So we can get you on the board as well with some. Is he on the auto checklist? We haven't pulled him yet. Bob, fortune teller mini rookie. Base. I'm not sure what checklist BGO is on. That's a good question. Gavin Lux, base. I'm guessing maybe the power portraits. It's not on the short print list. Wilson Ramos, oh, missing nameplate variation. On the board for Wilson Ramos spot. Oh, there you go. You're on the, on the Justin Dunn spot there. Cool deal. Congrats, Mr. Knet, too. Kino base. Riordan Fortune Teller Mini. Babe Ruth. High number short print. Did get him in the last case as well. So got a couple now. Variation. There we go. All right. Put a good one on the board here. Ah, Players Day weekend. Image variation. Trout. Well, action on the board here. Got the green tarot card to 99. I'm sorry. Green fortune teller mini to 99 in the first case. Variation action here in case number two. Players Day weekend. Who did you get in this one, Dan? Brian Reynolds, Black White Parallel. Because, I mean, the, the base set has 320 spots, and I think there was 328 listings total. So there should only be a couple guys that have hit only. Thirty out of fifty on the Brian Reynolds Black White. Base. Yep, still looking for that first bazooka. I'm kind of surprised we haven't hit one yet.
Bueller. Um, silvers or the black white, you mean? I'm sorry. These black white or silver, if you want to call them. One in every 50 hobby packs. I'm not sure. I haven't seen any uh, retail odds. Or if they are in retail, I'm not sure. I know all the variations should be. Oh, they're in the retail mega box. Gotcha. So they are different. My bad. Then I take that back then. I'm not sure what the retail odds on of those entirely are. Cool deal. Thanks for the assist on that one, Mike. Fact check. <laughs> There we go. All right. Itch my curiosity there. Finally got one. Bazooka back. First of the case, uh, Blake Snell. On the board. <laughs> Man. Peace. Yeah, green in the hanger packs. I remember picking up some of those in years past. Well, they have the three or four pack uh, green parallel. Or is it a full five card pack? All right, so we should set, we should have our uh, second autograph as well coming up here. Here we go. Put it on the board. Corey Dickerson that is the first auto, first hit here for the Dickerson spot. Congrats, indeed. So Matt Beatty, Indigo Auto to 150. Corey Dickerson, the nice trout variation short print, Players Day weekend. Bazooka back short print on Blake Snell. Lord Ramos on the missing nameplate. Referring to his, what is it, his heritage photo. <laughs> Looks like that. <laughs> I don't know. Just a little imposing. All right, box number five coming up. Case number two. There we go. Three packs and a five pack of greens. Uh huh. And those greens, even though they're not numbered right, those even make for good grading possibilities too, because retail doesn't get bought up as much in bulk, and certainly maybe not as many of those greens get graded. So you get a nice green or a nice trout green or something. Looks good. Get it graded. Turn, turns it into a limited offering. Limited pop. You know, limited. Card with a limited population report. Freddie. All right, put on the board Freddie Freeman. Indigo Chrome Refractor to 150. Ben Attendee. And Francisco. Eighty-seven out of one fifty on the Frederick the Great. <laughs> no love for the man. Well, we did get the indigo, or it was a chrome to ninety-nine in the first case on him. Let's see if we can get you a little action on the board. In case number two here, Syndergaard, tarot card. 
trying to do the math in my head. I'm like, how many? We got 10. Yeah, I mean, it's tough, right? There's 10 number to 150. I mean, 10 indigo parallels to 250 per case. So indigo parallel could take up to 30 cases if you think about it. AJ Puck. We did get him. In. Yeah, we did see him with the hair, right? The hair with the flare. <laughs> All right, back on the board for the AJ Puck spot. Congrats on this one. First auto out of this box. Base. Nikki Lopez. Indigo parallel to 250. Know, 239 out of 250 on this one. But you'd figure, too, he's got chrome and base. So, yeah, would have hoped to run into a little bit more than just a couple there over that many cases for sure. Because <laughs> the next is the new Henry Owens. Oh, we were good. Yeah, Henry Owens. I'm sure I got a few still sitting around here as well. He was a local kid from down here, so I kind of didn't mind sitting on his stuff, but it hasn't panned out, so to say. Luis Robert, fortune teller mini rookie. Put the inserts on the side. Jeremy, uh, any Astudio in this case? Well, no, we got the auto on him in the last case, right? Let me take a quick pick some up. Yeah, the blue was the blue auto on him last case. No Tortuga, or did we? I thought I said Tortuga in this case, didn't I? Nelly Cruz. I'm sorry. I'm, just, I'm like, I swore I thought I did say him. Nope, we didn't. Okay. So not nothing on uh, Astudio in this one yet. Base. Box number five. Dylan Cease, missing nameplate, variation rookie. Oops. Yeah, Moto Base. Oh, no problem, sir. So, hope to put something on the board here for you. Hey, Jeremy, did you ever see, what is BGO on? Is, did you find him? I'm kind of still curious what he's in, because it's got to be the power performers. And if it is, he's only, he's, yeah, he'd be one of a couple guys that's a one-on-one. George Brett is another one that's only guys a power performer, or power performers portrait patch. That's what it is. Jackie Robinson. High number, short print. Back on the board for the Robinson spot. to get one in case number one as well? Make sure there's no bazooka back action on those. Base. Ah, gotcha. Oh, here we go. Black white parallel to 50. Nice. Jacob DeGrom. All right. Put it on the board for the DeGrom spot. Put 
23 out of 50. Very nice. Oh. Come on, Thomas. Where's the beef? <laughs> it's dinner time. Well, good meal to you, good sir, and uh, hopefully we can pull you a little something in between here. AJ Puck, first autograph on the board in this box. Verlander, tarot card. Logo swap coming. Adam Adovino, Mr. Zero. Logo swap variation. Or logo swap parallel. Base card, all right. Base. Second auto should be coming up. Nico, looking for some Nico action. Well, Brandon McKay, mini rookie. Gavin Lux, rookie. Oh, I was just talking about him having an auto. Put it on the board for the Austin Meadows spot. Logo swap autograph to 99. So yeah, the Lou Bob Redemption uh, logo swap auto will be to 99 then unless he's short printed. 51 of 99. Congrats on this one. Julio. And last pack of box number five, which will get us now to the halfway point here on case number two. Base. Quick check here for a bazooka back. Yeah, real quick. Okay, box number six. Austin Meadows logo swap auto to 99 and uh, AJ Puck rookie auto in that box. Nice Jake DeGrom black white parallel to 50. Throw in the Freddie Freeman to 150 chrome. Here we go. Nice Christian Yelich on the board here. Indigo Chrome to 150. Let's 
KB, David, looking for some action on him, good sir. And Jorge Polanco, base chrome. Oh, Christian Yelich action. He's got autos. Let's see if we can run into one. 120 out of 150. Flaherty uh, story. I'm going to have to look around for it. Fortune Teller Mini, Vlad Jr. Looking for some action on Vladdy as well here. Some of the big boys. Cunha, Alonzo. A little Glaber Day action. Got the nice variation on Trout earlier here. See if we can add as well. Petey, tarot card. Tatis. Otto, put it on the board. Hello, Newman. Kevin Newman. Autograph action. On the board. And congrats on this one. <laughs> uh, well, I appreciate the interest there, sir. Domingo Leyva. That is a uh, Indigo to 250, yeah. That gets the Leyva spot on the board. A little rookie parallel action. 171 out of 250. Otani, Fortune Teller Mini. Base. Eight packs in. Take a quick peek here. Missing nameplate variation. Is that Tyler Alexander. Who is that for a second? Alexander spot on the board. Trevor Story tarot card. Bob Bass, The Judge, Yastrzemski, my number short print, back at it, did get him in case number one as well, last few have been uh, duplicates as well from the last case with uh, the Babe, Jackie, and Yastrzemski, all to get in a little double up action. Double check, no bazooka back action there. Bichette, base rookie. Variation coming up. All right, good luck on this one. Aaron Nola, back for some more. We got him earlier, parallel and a variant. This is the uh, Plagers Dave image variation short print on the board. These are what, one in 150... One in 150, so C1, sometimes two per case. And put it on the board for the Aaron Nola spot. Congrats there. 
your Dan back at it. Black white parallel coming up. Number out of fifty. Oh, nice Bobby Bradley. Got the rookie auto earlier. Rookie parallel. And numbered. Five out of fifty. Congrats there. A couple pucks looking for some Lizardo action for you as well. <laughs> they still running the ponies? Yeah, I guess so, right? Interesting. No bazooka back on that one. All right, last few stacks here of box number six. Case number two, coming up. Nico, base rookie. Chapman, Tarot. Yasmani Bazooka back. There you go. Nice little Yasmani Grandal. Bazooka back short print. On the board for the Yaz spot. I guess you got three of them now with Mike and Carl Yastrzemski and then uh, Yasmani. Bazooka back. Yeah, it's kind of like a, uh, I don't know, like on the weekends, they're throwing on events from like, you know, the, it's just weird, right? Kind of that eerie feeling like, I don't know, I guess I'll sit there for a few minutes, make me feel kind of warm, but then after a few minutes, I'm like, eh, I can't do this. I mean, this, is a few, this is stuff from last year. I hear you there, man. Thanks. Boba Chef, Fortune Teller Mini Rookie. The other, yeah, is Mike Yastrzemski base. Second auto should be coming up here. We've got the Kevin Newman to lead it off. Muncie, back at it, boy. You got the, uh, yeah, we got the hard auto on him too, right? Plus the garment autograph to 50 in this case, and add the hard auto. Maxwell strikes again. Congrats there. Little double Muncie in this case. Last pack of box number six, case number two. Box number seven coming up. Also got the uh, nice bazooka back. Yasmani Grandal. Aaron Nola. Players Day weekend variation. Alexander on the nameplate. Even though we got one in this box. Unlikely to find two, but you never know. Nico Horner, base rookie. All right, number seven coming up. There's some stuff that are, are cool to sit through. Yeah, 99 All-Star Game, that's pretty memorable there back at uh, Fenway, right? That was a good one. Classic with the uh, Ted Williams, Tony Gwynn. Right? Barely 20 years ago, and just times have changed here. Chrome Topper coming up. Senior Strasburgo, two for two on the Chrome Parallels. Got one in the first case. 
This is the blue to 99 as well. I think the other one was 99 as well. So I'm going to have two of the 99 for you now. Merrifield and Rizzo, base chromes. Seventy-six out of ninety-nine on this one. Let's see if we can get a little variation action or numbered action on the base set as well. Oh, very nice. Well, pretty good on Maxwell so far with the garment auto there and double up with the auto. And also we got him in case number one, right? Yeah. Scherzer, fortune teller mini. Cunha, Wheel of Fortune, Tarot. Shed Long, put it on the board. Black White Autograph, it's a 50 on this one. 9 out of 50. Did we get Shed? No, I don't think we've seen Shed Long earlier. So that is going to get them on the board. It's our second black white in the case, right? Because we got the Messina. Yeah, Messina to start it. Strong. Put it on the board. Logo swap very there you go, nice Dustin May. Logo swap variant. Got the rookie auto on him in case number one. Back on the board. Nico in the hit spot base of course all right still look it's fine still got a ways to go but we'd like to get some action on that spot in particular as well luba base cunha see i'm not sure what his autos are and if they're insert autos then they're obviously very tough but i'm not sure i gotta double check is he on the base auto set as well in which case where is he at we'd like to get one on the board Brendan McKay, missing nameplate variation. Back on the board, got the gold refractor on the GQ chromes to 50 to start off this case. All right, nice little variation here. Looking for an auto along the way as well. Let's see if we can find it. Again, missing nameplate variations, about one in 30 cases if everything breaks equally. Devers, Tarot. Astudio, Fortune Teller Mini. Deion Sanders, back on the board to get one in the first case. Prime time. Uh, double check. No bazooka back. Peace. Base on base. Andres Munoz, blue or indigo? Indigo rookie parallel to two fifty.
on the board for the Munoz spot here. 54 of 250. Shed long, black, white auto, first auto on the board here. Still got the second auto coming up. Box number seven, case number two. Jordan, tarot card rookie. Ah, there we go. Red parallel, I mean, they're one in, what, 600 packs, so definitely a tough hit on these. Good to see a red parallel to 10, put it on the board. Ah, that's a nice one. Nice yacht here. Red bird. My future Hall of Fame parallel. Nine out of 10 on this one. Congrats to the Molina spot. Very nice. Yeah, one in one in six hundred and five. Every cup, two forty in a case, so two two and a half cases, which really a pretty pretty good odds there to hit a parallel to ten compared to some other products. Tatis Fortune Teller Mini. Back on the board, Matthew Beatty, professional hitter. Got the Indigo Auto to 150 in the first case. Base Auto here, case number two. Congrats to the Beatty spot. So Shed Long to 50, Beatty base in box number seven here, case number two. Nice Yachty Marlena, red parallel to 10. McKay, missing nameplate rookie. Box number eight coming up. Yeah, a nice parallel on him like that would go pretty good ways too. So sorry I didn't get that one, but we'll see if we can run into at least a nice parallel and add a nice auto in the mix here before everything's said and done. Chrome topper coming up. back-to-back -back national parallels right we got the uh, Strasburg to 99 on the last box maxi to 150 on this one Nelly Cruz Strasburg base Fifteen out of one fifty on the Scherzer. Did get the nice Scherzer uh, bazooka back in the first case. A little action there. You know, I'm just trying to think about it. I'm. This is our fourth or fifth case. I have to go back, but I think we've got a Dodger in every case to some extent. I might not be far off saying that, or maybe at least out of four out of the five cases we've seen uh, overall on this product, but they seem to be a plentiful. Or that we've gotten extremely lucky, one of the two, maybe a little bit of both. Verlander, tarot card. 
So that's probably a good thing to note is that there's probably a higher print run of some guys, right? So pretty certain there's more Matt Beatty's than, say, Chris Bryant's are obviously the non unnumbered guys. But we don't know exactly for sure, so it would be nice to have a definitive idea on those. Ice and Diaz. Yeah, we did. This is uh, did get Mr. Diaz in the first case as well, so maybe a little duplicate action on the Beatty and the Diaz sequence. All right, congrats. Do apologize to the other spots. It's going to happen through four cases. It's a little maybe more frustrating seeing it back-to-back -back cases like that. Yeah, definitely one of the advantages on this product, more so than, say, the last few years. No offense or nothing, but the last few years, the early season rookie crop and the products was just not that really you know wealthy maybe 2018 was a little better but still last year was still a little bit um you know lacking indigo oh, i thought it was a blue bob indigo eugenio suarez to get the chrome parallel on him 29 out of 250 on this one Dante, no Bauer action for you, good sir. Not at least nothing to note of yet. Base. Um, uh, half an hour. Otani, fortune teller. I'll get it. Oh, okay. Cool. Thank you. Quick peek here for a busy back. Yeah, when we find one, you'll notice they stick out pretty noticeably. But it seems to be we seem to have caught out all of them to up until this point here. Chemo base. Alex Bregman missing nameplate variation in this box. Congrats on this one. Syndergaard, tarot card. Uh, David, I see what you're trying to do there. <laughs> so, yeah, see if we can get the wheel oiled a little bit for you there, good sir. Aaron Judge, Fortune Teller Mini. Roberto Clemente got the nice blue short print parallel to 150 in the first case. Standard high number short print here. Congrats on this one. Blue parallel coming up to 150. Tommy Pham. Thirty of one Tarot card mini coming up. Uh, parallel, excuse me. Well, 
who do we have here? Nice Bellinger. 232 out of 250 on this one. There we go. Got the judge, right, in the last case. Bellinger on this one. At least you have a nice look to them. Kind of unique with the rounded edges. Face. Marte. Sunny Gray. Logo swap. Dante still looking for some Bauer action for you, buddy. Logo swap parallel on Sunny Gray spot here. Bichette, Fortune Teller, Mini Rookie. Lux. McCullers Jr. Yeah, we did run into him as well in this sequence in the first case. Put it back on the board. Congrats on this one. Last pack of box number eight, case number two. Base. Uh, I gotta clean these up real quick. All right, Chromebox Topper coming up. There we go, a little Vladdy action. Blue to one uh, to ninety-nine. No, Indigo to one fifty. Will Smith, Austin Meadows. Thomas, still looking for the Max Kepler action for you, buddy. We're usually good on him. Been hitting him in a number of products. Well. I don't think that should that'll stop here on this one. Let's see if we can get them before we end these last two boxes for you. Dylan Cease, Fortune Teller, Mini Rookie. Chapman, Tarot. Ooh, a redemption. Well, we know who it was last time. Who's it going to be this time? Good luck. Gio Urshela. Didn't we pull his auto, but it was live in the first case? I mean, he's got live and redemption. Yeah, we pulled Giovanni, I remember. So I guess, okay, Urshela has live autos plus redemption then. That's been established here. Congrats for the Urshela spot. Redemption auto there.
Kevin Kramer, Indigo Parallel to 250. Seventy-seven out of two fifty on this one. Geo in there a lot. Oh, it's the first redemption we pulled on him. I'm trying to think if we pulled any other live autos, but that's probably gonna, probably going to help. I would imagine. Imagine there's more of him than because of the uh, redemptions, unless they couldn't get them all fulfilled for some reason. Maybe that's another issue. All right, we'll be, pay attention on that one then. Who did we pull? Max Scherzer is a, is a redemption at one point as well. We pulled him in one of the team breaks. Hanser Alberto, missing nameplate variation in this box. Pete Alonzo, Taro. Trout, Fortune Teller Mini. Greg, welcome aboard, good sir. Lou Bob, base rookie. Onus Wagner, high number short print in this box. Did get the nice uh, missing nameplate. Variation Wagner in the first case. A little base action here. Congrats, indeed. That's short prints, especially learn nice looking cards with the frame and everything to kind of get graded on those or the rookie cards to just nice base cards in general. Quick check here for some bazooka back action. Dom Nunez. Indigo, take that back. Blue rookie parallel to 150. Your Dan. Ninety-two out of one fifty for the Dom Nunez spot. Bregman, Taro, Sam Hilliard, Logo Swap Rookie, Labor, Fortune Teller Mini. Auto. Put it back on the board. Colby Allard. Black, white, auto. Got the base auto for the Allard spot in the first case. Congrats on this one. Yeah, he's a guy we hadn't seen in our first three cases. I got him back to back on these. Congrats, congrats. 17 of 50 on that black white auto. Is that our third? Yeah, that's our third black white auto of this case. Base. 
All right, box number 10 coming up. Quick check here on the bazooka backs. All right, good luck, good luck. Full recap on case number two coming up right after this box. And I'll post the starting link again for case three tomorrow. Let's see if we can finish it with an auto. Trevor Story Base, Trevor Story Indigo. Don't take that back. Blue to 99. Sixty-five of ninety-nine on the Trevor story. Logan Allen. I'm not sure if it's Bobby Bradley and Logan Allen if they alternate, but usually we see. Some form or the other here. Maybe we got a couple of back. We got Bradley on the board. Maybe he wouldn't be surprised to see uh, Logan Allen at some point here. Yelich, Tarot. Alt two. First auto. This last box. There you go. Carter Kibu. Put it on the board. Autograph action here. We didn't get a parallel on him in the first case. On the board. Nico. Nope. Base Nico. Maybe's for Loria. Blue to 150. Actually, that's an indigo to 250. Savale, that's who we've had. We hit two Aaron Savales. Two Savales, one Bradley. So yeah, would be surprised if we don't run into uh, Logan Allen here at some point. But do apologize. Looking to get on the board still here. Well, Fortune Teller Mini Hera. Jordan. Michelle Bias, missing nameplate rookie variation. Did get the rookie auto on him, I believe, to start this case. King of Swords, Chris Bryant. Base. Four. Oh, Fortune Teller Millie. Ah, Mini Paul DeYoung. David! Started uh I believe so. If I sent you the offer and you paid for it, then you're good for it. Yeah. If I send it to you and you paid for it, you're good for it. And yeah, two bases avail on the board. 
Gavin Lux base. There we go. King Griffey Jr. High number short print on the board. Uh, wrinkles. All right. We'll start around the junior spot now. Looking for him. G fam, how you doing, buddy? Um, probably more so in the first case on some of the bigger hits. This case has been a little lacking on some of the key, a top tier name here. Variation coming up in the first case. We had Lux, uh, Aquino. We had uh, Lou Bob Auto to 99. Wow, another Aaron Nola. Am I? He's on a little tear. Okay, we got the same. Yeah. We got the variation in Players Day Weekend variation in this case. Add the logo swap as well. So double variations for the Aaron Nola spot. One in every 350 on these. Every case and a half, give or take. Adam, howdy, good sir. Uh, box number 10, case number 2. So we'll be resuming tomorrow with cases three and four, and no Pete. Yeah, no, been been light on Pete so far. Let's see if we can get him on the board with a nice parallel, let alone a nice big auto for you. Hey, well, there's a nice Altuve parallel, black white to fifty. Rob, inch our way closer here. Hopefully, I know <laughs> you said to acknowledge it's a tough shot on the lineup auto card, but hey. It's a possibility. 31 out of 50 on the two bay. Black white. Oh, cool deal, man. You got a garment auto for you then. Excellent. Glad to put it on the board for you, good sir. Aaron Noll, tarot card. And what we got? Aaron Noll in the hit spot upside down. Oh my goodness. Aaron Nola. Every which way here. Players Day Weekend Image Variation. Players Day Weekend Image Variation Logo Swap. Bazooka back. I think we got a parallel on him as well in the case. So if we're not hitting an auto or anything, I've got a lot going on. And then this is our third bazooka back as well. So three in this case as well as the first case on the bazooka backs. Chavis, Fortune Teller Mini. Three packs to go in this final box of case number two. Bo. Oh, second auto, Dustin May. Put it back on the board. Did get one in the first case as well. So congrats to the May spot. Apologies to everybody else there. I know several guys that doubled up in this case. Well, I'll tell you what. Hang on, we're going to do a little bonus action. We have kind of always do some bonus, some form of bonus action. Especially with this case having so many duplicates. Not as hot as the first case. I think we could use an extra boost here. One second, let me check for bazooka backs, but uh, we'll be adding a bonus box. Usually on these bigger breaks, we try to add a, a bonus box here or there. Sometimes the margins don't allow it, but thankfully I do have plenty of Gypsy Queen, and we do have the margins on this product to do so. So let's do it.
So not only we're going to do one today, we'll, we're going to set a box open for tomorrow as well. So stay tuned. At the end of case number four, we're going to do a bonus box as well tomorrow. But bonus box coming up here for today. Let's see if we can put it on the board here for somebody that hasn't seen any action. Or we'll see if this box at least has some autos. Hmm. This guy's trying to make an escape for it. Okay. Well, lovely if it works out, right? <laughs> uh, let's see. I know the crowd probably doesn't want to see someone we just hit. Let's see if we can make it count with a nice numbered hit on the auto. And Paul DeYoung. Going to get the parallel here in the bonus Chrome Pack. Chapman, Logan Allen rookie. Paul DeYoung. It's an indigo to 150. We'll do a full recap here in just a moment as well. So it'll be case number two plus a box. All right. Good luck. <laughs> no, I just know when we get a rough case and, right, usually we try to save some of the uh, margins for individual spots and orders, but I think the group could use this as a whole here as well. That second case was a little lacking. Some solid hits in there, but compared to the first case, we had multiple big hits in the first case. A little Judge Mini. <laughs> Not a nameplate. That'd be freaky, but possible. Blue Bob base rookie. Okay. Well, put him on the board. Back on the board. Robo Garcia. Rookie auto. Mm, I don't know if we got him in case one or in case two, but we did get him earlier along with Al Zole. We got him in case number one, actually. So back on the board for the Al uh, Robo Garcia spot here. All right. Congrats on this one. First auto out of the box. Bonus box. Oh, very cool. Red parallel. Nice. All right. Going to get a little something out of the ordinary out of this box at least. Red parallel to 10. Let's make it count. Put it on the board. Oh, David. Hey, that's a nice card. Very nice. Bonus action for the KB spot. Nice red parallel to 10. Very nice. Eight out of ten. Put it on the board, good sir. 605 packs, that's what? 20? 25, 26 boxes? So that's pretty decent from a consumer standpoint. You know, to get a, a nice par possible parallel to ten. With all the nice rookies in this set, every 25 or 30 boxes, you kind of have a better feeling about your odds on some of those, right? Parallels to 10 and some other products. A lot, lot, lot rougher. Base. Well, that's cool, all right. See if we can make it, make it last. Uh, I'll get a nice parallel auto on the second auto here. KP Tarot card. So a couple nice red parallels now because we got the uh, Yadier Molina there in the second case. Very nice. Junior, fortune teller mini. Well, thank you, sir. I know it's tough on a player break. It can kind of take a while, but we try to give everybody a look at what they're getting, or at least what they're possibly getting. Pedro, high number short print in this box. We did get PD in the case here, so that's two short prints for the Pedro Martinez spot now. Looks like he's uh, 
<laughs> it's like looking at you. He's like, you're not going to run because I'm going to bean you. Don't get on Petey's bad side. Well, thank you, sir. I appreciate the kind words. But really, it's a reflection of you guys as well, because obviously we can't do it unless you guys show up. So, works both ways there on the appreciation, right? Missing nameplate variation, Stephen Matz in this box. I'm going to have to wait for the Aranola. <laughs> Rainbow, I guess you call it still. Oh, that's interesting. See, he's got more pressure on the index finger there. You kind of can tell he's letting up on the middle finger. So what is that, a cutter? They're going to cut in? I always like looking at the grips, trying to figure out what they're trying to throw. Go try to do it in the backyard. <laughs> Break a window or go throw out the elbow. One of the two. Keston Hera, Fortune Teller Mini. Chapman, Tarot Card. Well, here's our second auto. Good luck. E.J. Puck for the third time. Well, we tried. We tried. Garcia got a double. AJ got his third. Still looking for some Lazardo action. But hey, pretty sweet Chris Bryant red parallel line. We got some some packs here left to pull something else. But all right, congrats to those spot, no doubt. AJ Puck back on the board. Thanks. Check these for Bazooka back at the end here. All right, see if we can throw up another parallel and or variation. Well, there's a nice one. You get these one, well, about one per case. Astudio. So nice, a couple of multi-case hit parallels, right? One in 300 or so on the uh, Fortune Teller Mini here. 113 out of 250. And then the red Chris Bryant. So pretty standard on the autos, but right, nice above average parallels in this box. Astudio. Fortune Teller Mini. And Indigo to 250 coming up. Brockstar. Fortune Teller Mini, cheers. Please. Your Dan, extra bonus rookie there. So we have Blue Bob, Bichette, Your Dan. Extra rookie action, never hurts. Thanks. All right, last two packs of this bonus box, and then we'll do the full. Case number two recap, including uh, the bonus box. Odin, looking for you, buddy. See if we can get you some action on the board. Even a variation or numbered stuff here. Definitely a no show on these, so I do apologize in that regard. That's not fun watching there. Bregman, Tarot. Alrighty. Last pack, certainly do appreciate everyone again for hanging out, joining, watching cases one and two today. Daryl Agrizol. Logo swap rookie for the Agrizol spot.
Congrats there. Sue. All right, quick check here just to make sure. And we did get a bazooka back in that last box to give us three for the case. So three in the last case as well. So yeah, by, by way of margin of hits, definitely a little hotter in the first case. But, did get some good ones here in the second case. Let's take a look. Let's separate the base from the numbered stuff. Double Muncie action there with the Garment Auto. Austin Meadows as well. A lot of parallel action as well here. Some cases where we've only seen three parallels. Each of the first two cases, now we've seen five, and I think six in this one. Yeah, let me see, that makes six. Okay, so, well, take your pick here. Three, four autos to 50 in this case. Garment Auto, Max Muncy. On card, 26 out of 50. Congrats there. Nice Mike Mucina here. That's the first one I've seen on him. Black, White, Mucina. Nice Hall of Fame auto indeed. I got the Cooperstown logo there, of course. 31 out of 50. Shed Long, Black, White. 9 out of 50. Colby Allard, Black Wyatt, 17 out of 50. Logo Swap Auto, nice hit for the Austin Meadows spot here. 51 of 99. Matt Beatty, professional hitter Matt Beatty. Indigo Auto, 77 of 150. Standard issue autographs from this case. Baez, rookie, uh, oh, a lot of rookie autos here. Savale, Al Zole, Bobby Bradley. Corey Dickerson, Puck, Newman, Muncy, Beatty, Diaz, McCullers, Gio Urshela Redemption, Keyboom, Dustin May, Robel Garcia, and AJ Puck. Parallels. Let's separate these here real quick. Okay, so let's start from the top. We did get a red parallel in the second case. Nice out here, Molina. Put it on the board for the Molina spot. Nine out of ten. Oops, got a few more here to finish off. Let me finish these. Okay, there we go. And then a Chris Bryant from the bonus box. Sweet. David, congrats there, man. 8 out of 10. All right, puts you on the board. Let's see if we can do some damage for you tomorrow in cases 3 and 4. 5 black-white parallels, just like the first case. And then we did get 2 gold refractors in the chrome toppers, which we didn't see in the first case. Nice Brandon McKay, gold refractor, rookie. 3 out of 50. Verlander, GQ chrome gold refractor. 2 out of 50. Black-white parallels here, numbered out of 50. Five of them. Austin Hayes. Brian Reynolds. Nice Jake DeGrom. Bobby Bradley, rookie. Altuve. Chrome Blues to 99. Three of them in this case. Nelly Cruz. Strasburg. And Trevor Story. Chrome Topper Indigos to 150. De Young, Vlad Jr., Scherzer, Yelich, Freddie Freeman, Eugenio Suarez. Parallels to 150 up first. Let's do the separate these. Indigos are to 250.
Okay. Blue parallels from the base set number to 150. We had six of them. Devers, Hosmer, Sammy Sosa high number short print to 150. Another short print blue, 45 of 150. Justin Dunn, Tommy Pham, Dom Nunez. Indigo parallels number to 250. Five, ten, thirteen of them. Probably picked one up in the bonus box and a couple of inserts here as well. Take out the inserts first. Two fortune teller mini ind uh, indigos to 250. Astudio from the bonus box. Paul De Young to 250 as well. Tarot card blue indigo, I'm sorry, in this case, Bellinger, 232 out of 250. Indigos to 250, Mullins, Valoria, Holt, uh, Kiermeyer, Suarez, Munoz, Maliba, Nicky Lopez, Danny Duffy, Matt Olson. Cool deal, Derek. Thank you, good sir. G fam, always appreciate kind words, good sir. Variations, short prints. Let's go over these logo swaps versus a mini missing nameplates, bazooka backs. Players Day Weekend, variation as well. Yeah, Aaron Nola. The nice Trout Players Day Weekend short print in this case to get them on the board. JD on the Jackie Robinson day as well in this case. All right, so let's go in terms of the rarest here. Would be the uh, Aaron Ola, Players Day Weekend logo swap. Every case and a half on these. Just about twice as rare as the normal variation there. Oh, we're not done. He also got the standard. Players Day Weekend Image Variation Short Print. One Players Day Weekend Short Print as well. Mike Trout on this one. So we got two plus the variation in this case. Congrats. And Jackie Robinson Day Image Variation Short Print. J.D. Martinez. Three Bazooka Backs in this case. Mm -hmm. Mr. Nola. Yasmani Grandal and Blake Snell. Logo swap parallels here. Eight of them in this case. Moran, Verlander, Hampson, Ottavino, Dustin May, Sonny Gray, Sam Hilliard, and Dario Agrizal. Actually, so seven in the case, one from the bonus box. About what we saw in the first case was seven. And then missing name plate variants. Ten plus the one from the bonus box. Christian Vasquez, Austin Meadows, not Mancini, Anthony Santander, Wilson Ramos, Dylan Cease rookie, Tyler Alexander, Brendan McKay rookie, Alex Bregman, Hanser Alberto, Michelle Baez, and Steven Matz. Oh, well, thank you, Dave. Glad to get the Chris Bryant on the board for you there, kid, sir. See if we can work on that auto tomorrow. High number short prints, uh, one per box. So we got 11, 10 plus the bonus box for 11 here. Pedro, Griffey, Wagner, Clemente, Primetime, Deion Sanders, Yastrzemski, Jackie Robinson, Babe Ruth, Reggie Jackson, Sosa, and Ted Williams. Gypsy Queen Chrome. We did the parallels. The base from this case, Chapman, Logan Allen, Chapman. Story, Will Smith, Meadows, Cruz, Straws, Merrifield, Rizzo, Bryant, Polanco, Benny, Lindor, Verlander, Puck, Mookie Betts, Bryce Harper, Seth Brown, Chris Bryant, Marte, Jose Abreu, and uh, based on Curtis's calculations, thereabouts, saying there's roughly 630 of these chromes per player, although they're not numbered. 
based upon pack odds and everything, that's what he's coming out to. And I think he's just a rep out right on that one. Quick count on the rookie spots. We saw eight Jordan base in the first case. Just curious to see how he did here. So base counts should be varying between at least five and seven. Some players probably did get eight. Doesn't seem like as many Aquinos. We'll take a count here. Jordan. All right, what's the count on you, buddy? Eight again. So eight in the first case, eight in the second case. That's pretty good. Bo Bichette. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, uh, yeah, we did get one of these each in the bonus box. So probably was seven Jordans in the case. And seven Bichettes here, so it's probably six in the case then. G Lux. Three, six here total. Lou Bob. Six total as well. And Aquino. Yeah, only to get four Aquinos there. So, been a little light on his count somehow, but probably just missing on his count. All right, gang. Well, that is going to wrap it up. Reminder, we are adding an extra bonus box for tomorrow. Just in case the guys walk through, but make sure nobody touches this. Bonus action. Stay tuned for that one tomorrow. That is going to wrap it up on today's first two cases. Once again, certainly do appreciate everyone again for hanging out, watching, during the breaks. Congrats again to those that did get hits. Apologies to those that are still waiting to get some action on the board there. See if we can put it on the board for you. Starting case number three. And uh, let me post the link one more time for you guys. Same, same schedule tomorrow. Noon Pacific start time, 3 p.m. Eastern. We'll do case number three, and then we'll come on back and do case number four uh, around 5.45 Eastern, 2.45 Pacific. There we go. All right, gang. Odin's Inventor Toy Box, good sir. Well, do enjoy the outdoors there, sir. Certainly hope to put some action on the board for you tomorrow. Do be on the lookout. Usually we do try to look at some of the uh, lightest performing spots and add some extras there. Uh, certainly, if you wouldn't have, hopefully we don't have to resort to that. But uh, from time to time, we do kick back on the lesser performing spots, at least as much as we can without draining any of our uh, profit. Well, without draining it completely, obviously. Well, once again, do appreciate everyone again for hanging out, watching cases one and two. Do hope you guys enjoy the rest of your Friday evening out there, and we'll be back tomorrow. Till then, everybody do take care, and we'll see you.